Hey YouTube, Ryan Pax here, and I'm going to have a look at the Halo 3 Grunt. And here he is standing next to Master Chief. And I think he's a little bit taller than what he should be as a Grunt for the scale-wise goes. But I think if he was much smaller, he wouldn't be a very good figure. And I'm actually pretty surprised with this one. I, After the, the Rookie, I really like this guy a lot. Um... Uh, as far as articulation goes, it says he has 22 moving parts. I haven't bothered to count them. But the head, 360s, and the neck can go up and down, forward and back. You can pull the gas mask off. I guess it's not really a gas mask. I guess it's probably some sort of breathing thing. And it just pegs right back into his mouth. Uh, he has ball joint shoulders. Uh, there's a swivel under the shoulder for that allows the arm to 360 and it just has peg elbows not very far range of motion for the peg elbows but they work um, there's a joint in the torso that I don't really understand it just kinda it doesn't really move much and it leaves a big gap so I think they could have done without that uh, ball joint hips same as the elbow sorta not a lot of motion from them I'm afraid to push them too far because they feel like they would break. Uh, they swivel just below the hip. And then the knees are also ball joints, so they bend pretty decently. A lot better than the elbows. And they do swivel below the knee. And then his foot is just on a peg, and that will swivel through 60 also. They have really weird feet, like club feet. And then uh, for accessories, he came with the plasma rifle. A plasma pistol, which mine, the paint job kind of sucks, and it's really bent. And he also comes with the little plasma grenade, which I have given to my Master Chief. And then he comes with his little medallion chip double kill. And it has the Halo 3 on the back. Surprisingly, this was a pretty good figure. I was kind of hesitant to pick him up at first because of the rookie. I thought, you know, if... You know, that one I kind of got bad luck on, but it seemed like it was pretty hit or miss with that figure. But this one is pretty good. I I think for the $10 I got him for at Target, which was cheaper than Toys R Us, that uh, this is a, a pretty good figure. And it'll be nice to have him posed with my Master Chief. So if you find him, I recommend picking him up. And thanks for watching. Good figure.